Hi, I'm Jamie Cook with NRHA and Hardware Retailing Magazine. We recently got a chance to take a trip down to Pompano Beach, Florida, but not for any spring break activities. This time, the mission was to check out a recent store conversion at Reliance Paint and Coatings. Uh, my partner John and I opened up Reliance nine years ago. We've been in this facility four years, matter of fact, uh, last month. When we moved in here, this was an old Ace Hardware store. Uh, actually, it was falling down around itself here. It was about ten little rooms. Uh, it was a real mess, you know, when, when we bought it. Uh, the good news was it was a hardware store, so it was very easy to kind of translate into a uh, paint store. So we kind of ripped it apart, put it back together with the help of Benjamin Moore in the world of computers. Uh, and many, many people within Benjamin Moore and in our employees, we picked around how we wanted to design the store. And what we came up with, one time we had the counter in the middle, we had it on the wall, we had a lot of different things. But what we decided to do was make the store not only aesthetically to look nice, which is what everybody wants, but we wanted it to be nice uh, for the walk-in customer. We do a lot of retail business. Uh, as you can see, we do a lot with the painting contractor, and believe it or not, painting contractors like a clean store, an organized store also. Then what we really wanted to do was make it very, very efficient. We wanted to make it good for the employees. Uh, then basically what we needed to do was make it very productive. So when the store was laid out, it was primarily really designed to be very open and warm, and again, very, very effective. But we wanted the real open, uh, the warmness, that's why as we go through the store, you'll see everything is kind of geared to the entrance. Yes, Benjamin Moore was fantastic for us here. Um, they came in with a CAD program, completely laid it out. We, we moved things around, we juggled ideas, but uh, without Donna, the, the computer person, uh, with the store wouldn't look like this. When John and Jack were redoing the store, they wanted to focus on what a conversion could do for the customer. And they say tips like tapping into your manufacturer, like Ben Moore for them, helped in that mission. Well, it, it helps the consumer and the retailer. It, it helps the consumer because we've upgraded the shopping experience to a more memorable one. And, and through the signature program, we've been able to align products so that as the consumer is shopping, they can see everything they need within a certain category to complete the job. The last thing we want is for someone to come into a store and not be able to see and find and, and purchase everything that they need to complete the job. Uh, from the owner's standpoint, it creates that memorable experience in the consumer so that they know to come back to the store. The store has a nice presentation and the, and the store is remembered as being a store that has everything for the consumer. One of the things that we do in our business is it's a, it's a relationship business. Uh, when you're selling paint and any kind of paint like that, it is a relationship business of, of any kind. So we'd want, the first thing I need to do is establish that relationship as well, to set that benchmark for the kind of relationship that they should in turn have with their customers and so forth like that. Um, when they had, when they moved about eight, uh, five, year, five to six years ago, and they positioned themselves with Benjamin Moore as being, they want to be the top quality, the, the best place, place to buy paint. Not only Benjamin Moore paint, but they want to be the best place to buy paint. Benjamin Moore fits right in with their pro with that particular program because that's exactly what we're trying to be. We're trying to be, you know, the best paint in our field and in the market. So they fit right in there with it, and they uh, work with us and they look for us for advice. They take advantage of everybody that we have available um, to make their store looking like the way that it does today. I think I think the key difference and why we're successful is uh, to get the customer back in the store, and all the guys on the counter know that. It's Jack's job to bring him in here the first time, but it's your job to keep him here. And um, we, I, think, I think we have guys that are more knowledgeable than the big box stores on paint as a whole. And, uh, and they also, we outservice those guys. We, we give you the right product the first time. <laughs> uh, Benjamin Moore, we're very, very fortunate in that it is a very recognizable name. We're very proud of that. But people can go get a bucket of paint anywhere. So we do feel that we give them the right product at a fair price and we give them the service, service, service that they want. And we're out servicing everybody right now. We're working harder than we ever have. And again, during these sensitive times, it is a situation where I think that's, and that's my opinion, and, and again, my partner John 
I believe, feels the same way. Uh, if you're going to sit right now and just wait for something to happen, it isn't going to happen. We get a lot of support from Benjamin Moore. We get a lot of support from our vendors. But ultimately, it's up to us.